Oh, good old Manifest Destiny. Oh, it happened again! What? The fucking Earl, zoned in Earl's. like crazy people. Shooting at the 111 I love it. 6232 Hollywood Boulevard. Sounds like a homicide beef. Two of the dead guys. All oh, right, I remember we watched this. Oh God, this. yeah. So I'm always with the morphine. Get That's what we said last time. Yeah. All over the place. And here it comes again. Always up. with the fucking Judge morphine. Judge Pasadena took the big sleep yesterday. Morphine. He took had a the big sleep. More like less fiend. I made that joke last time. Didn't. No, I did. No, I did. You thought of it, but we like, said it. It was me. Is your memory really that fucking it's so good? You don't remember like when you. I don't know. You don't remember I'm when you you staff. made the noise hey, of God. like ugh. Listen, because you're, you listen. What you, what you don't remember is back in 2013. You good. said funsies on a video. Yeah, oh no, I said that. You yeah. don't remember inventing that. Oh no, no, I said that because uh, I remember my friend Duke said that, and so I remember when he said I was funsies and I laughed. Do you at him. also remember when Fatal Fury three? But came I, out? I, I, oh no, I, I was. I, just, I can't do this again. I was just talking about when I, when LP fun was said. That yeah. was just the term fun. But the word funsies, yeah, sure. Well, the word funsies is appropriate for the nice time guy. frame of the, of the L.A. Noir. So and, uh, yeah, if, if uh, Fatal Fury 3 came out the same year no, as... It did, not. it did come out the same year. It just came out, Fatal Fury 3 came out, like, Fox after the Real Battle, Battle yeah. Special. And no, that it was, came out before. They came out the same year, but it, but it was before, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah. shoot up this office. But yeah. you remember they were the same year. Yeah, that's not what the argument was about. We have two fisticuffs where this argument happened. Two? Really? I thought it was only one. No, there are two. Because it happened, and then you both forgot that the conversation ever happened at all and started doing it again in a different bit of your. Oh! Did you see that? I did. Fucking Roy just doesn't know how to drive. Wait, you just said no? No to driving? No, no he, he crashed into a car. Like oh. instantaneously. That would have been much different than if you hadn't if you had been controlling though. But then it cut away, because we can't see the AI making a No, it's shot. true. Remember remember they almost fucked up and then the I'm camera kinda cut away before we even saw it, so Alright. It's four twenty. Stiffs. Uh, run vice. Two stiffs. Hey look! Oh my god. We'll hear about the back again. Over by the bandstand. Bow, 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 bow. See what's left of the owner, Eddie McGoldrick. 26. McGoldrick. Wow. I know Eddie McGoldrick. He was a non com in my old that's unit. A, that's a name I don't know. Sorry to hear that. No. Waitress said he recently came into some money and bought the club. Who are the other? Is that an Irish name? Two musicians. McGoldrick? Yeah, probably. Know, Get this. They used to be in a four piece, but the trombone player and the drummer OD'd. Don't tell me. Lamont and Tyree? We've met the rest of the band. <laughs> now they're a no piece. <laughs> That's such a, a stupid around. joke, Roy. Right. That's so good, but it's because he said it, too. and he he's thought just like, yeah, it's funny. And they dead. completely sandbagged oh, it. Oh man, that was amazing. That's uncharacteristic <laughs> of Roy. Just having having uh, some yeah, fun at the homicide. Ah, Negroes died. Morphine. Always with the fucking morphine. Wow, that guy's dead as shit, holy fuck. Yeah, I think the guy in the last case looked dead like that, but it's kind of rare. It's always it's always bad when, like, your body seems to be intact, but there's just blood everywhere. It's, oh, because then somebody has to find out what where's, where it came from. Where's your puncture wound? Mm. My favorite one is where there's too much blood and no body. Oh. Yeah. Cause, that, look, Cause then that's too much blood for like someone splashed it there, throw you off. Yeah, yeah. Like, like a pig. They got the pig. Yeah, no, exactly. but it, it's like, you look at it and it's like, Human being doesn't survive without this much blood. You'd be survived. Somebody's be a dead corpse right now. You'd be surprised what a human body could survive. Get out of here, genie. Oh, there's that even more. So so sick of looking at that. Left in circulation. Why is this not just the morphine desk? <laughs> well, vice, you know. It just happens to be that this week's. Shenanigans is the morphine. This week's adventure is morphine week. It's like shark week. Everybody loves morphine. It's like heroin. Yeah. And there's no repercussions or, or drawbacks to it. Everybody loves taking the morphine. Was that supposed to be like everybody's working, working on the, the weekend? weekend? Yeah, it sounded like it. Is that, is that what that's? Jesus, that's a big crate of morphine. No, no, oh. it smokes. It's okay. What Ooh. smokes are you? packs to a carton. Hundred cartons or more. It looks like a couple of months' supply. Need all these smokes, bro. That's when smoking is really good for you too. Yeah, that's fuck. When doctors would recommend it. Doc, yeah. they're like, I, oh, well, anyway, you remember. 
Yeah, I do. It's a BAR. These look brand new. Never fired. Haven't been degreased yet. Oh, uh, yeah, they're all greasy. They slip out of your hands. Sure it's awful. Numbers. Nine out of ten this pregnant doctors' bears. wives agree smoke. that shooting guns while Chester smoking. Get the odd guy who sneaks one of them. Menthols. Out. How did he get three of them? I love the bar. I love the Army bar so much. Morphine, Army surplus weapons. The Army surplus valors. Sound familiar? We should get back you're, to the you're a good person for this case, Cole. Exactly it's almost like it was written for you. That's the one with the good reload, huh? It's. They're all, oh man. The bar is so much fun to play with in any game that it's in. Um, yeah, the the thing I like was was whenever the cigarette companies would advertise <laughs> looking at? the smooth throat mint, me menthol, or not menthol, but it was like, it's like not harsh on your throat, like those other brands. Yeah, the ones that I'll rip up your throat real good. Custom case. Someone cared for also, Carruthers was looking at the like 10 bullet holes in the wall. Oh, okay. okay. It's like, are we going to pretend that there ain't tar in this shit? Don't worry about that. Don't worry about the fact so, that you're smoking uh, chemicals that are click. labeled too hazardous for road work. Mm. <laughs> so those are the bullets that a trombone shoots out when you when you blow into it. That's what Riker was threatening everyone with. Oh yeah. If you don't tell me my Fucking beard is cool. Assassin. Hey man. If you don't congratulate me for plowing the new ensign. Neat trick. Then guess what? You get a Case trombone bullet in the throat. I've seen, I've seen uh, El Mariachi and and the the, the, tri the trilogy. I get the feeling that all the drug addicts in 1940s LA are really position. smart and capable because they all have secret hidden compartments and and fucking hidden passageways. Well, there must be yeah. one person in town that makes hidden things in your things. Mm -hmm. Like that's got to be it. Kept a stash close so you watched the Once Upon a Time in Mexico, Wally? I did. I'm sorry to hear that. Another day, another dollar. Johnny Depp walking around town with an FBI shirt on. Mm-hmm. He had that cool blind scene at the end, though. That was cool. That yeah, was the one cool thing, yeah. Can't pretend it wasn't cool. There's the murder weapon. Right here. This was stabbed <laughs> through all of them, and it made It's like a dolphin. It just jumps through your chest. Oh, man. They just wanted it more. Wow. Con congrats on discovering all of the clues. I like the, I like the, the spotlight holes. hanging and swaying gently on the stage. Somebody went hard on that side of they the room. They hated that one. How wall. did I not have to investigate that? That's weird. That's not important. Carruthers took case. care of it. Yeah. Mm. Hey, remember how uh, Wolfwood had a band? No. No. He was playing with, he was playing with those I'm guys. I'm sorry. Like, like maybe one scene. We ruined your entire train of thought. That's ah, fine. Uh, okay, oh, so no. we saw two... We saw so go home, take a rest. The interview person was over here. That's correct. Hey, what happened? Some people came in and shot the place up. That's a yeah. fancy bar, though. I'll tell yeah, you what. Yeah, it's nice. Well, it's a lounge bar. It's bigger I'm than normal. I'm Detective Phelps, administrative by squad. Welcome to the 111 Club, Detective. Feels like I've had half the LAPD in here today already. Yeah, because of the dead people. Talk to me. I like your little lay fang Any costume. Any idea who did the shooting? No idea. It was my day off. Then why are you here? If I'd been here, honey, I'd be full of holes just they like call the their ends. Oh, really? 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 Possibly She's... believable. Well, oh, that that look well, around. Yeah, you have. You no can't go evidence. on. You can't go on eyes anyway. Yeah, of you course not. You have no not. evidence on her. So of course not. Doubt, I guess. She might be telling the truth. Yeah. Mm. You have no intuition either. Yeah. Well, you must have some okay, thoughts. Well. We get Can't all go on the eyes. In here, officer. <laughs> Not always. Sometimes it's been wrong. Tell us about Eddie. Eddie didn't know a thing about running a nightclub. He came into some money and waltzed in and bought the place. The previous owner thought all his Christmases had come at once. <laughs> that's pretty <laughs> definitive. Yeah, that's see that. Where do you think? Yeah, that, uh, that one. My guess was that he was selling the sort of quality product that you don't need to advertise. Thank you for I your like help. that phrasing. He Trump homes. Head, but he was a decent boss. Alright, you go practice your combos, Life Fang. You do that. Over there. I mean in the corner. I guess. So wait, you don't want her to, to practice her combos? No, I just No, she'll just wait there for you. So well, she's are more you like doing anything. More like Chun Li in the live action movie. Or like no, oh, yeah. more like Chun Li in Marvel. Well, Fang it literally has a golden oh, red people? dress in like oh, DOA no, too. Oh, they have every fucking kind of fucking. Not in DOA too. 
dress. Not in DOA 2, there's only a couple costumes each. Aren't there like 15? In DOA 2? Yeah. I don't know if it's that high. Or am I thinking of DOA 2 hardcore? Yeah, that's probably it, actually. You're that always thinking more. about hardcore. Hey, you shut up, you. Yeah, I always like thinking about Virtua Fighter hardcore. No. Wow, that one stung extra hard. Stung or, or if you're feeling uh, fancy, ultimate Fuck. Virtua ah. Fighter. How are you not just always re prepared for this? Yeah. Because the wound is never not raw. Who's Brenda? Brenda is LA's most famous madam. And everyone knows it. Of course everyone knows it. like the Heidi Fleiss. Brenda pays her way. Are we cops or a collection agency? Or has it been around since the Bible? Our job is to keep it off the street so Joe Citizen and his wife can stroll around unmolested. Then we should change the law. Are you out of your mind? Every politician in America is against prostitution. <laughs> except when they're using them. So and they're never not up? using them. He objects to the LA is it okay. Friday? That's a weird Taking cut. That was the that weirdest cut. Is. Yeah, and that's the problem. Phelps being From that progressive is a little unrealistic bro. for the well, 40s. It's like he's like one of those high moral standard guys that are like, God, there's a movie that's that's a lot like he's that. He's a stick in the mud. Oh, but, no, but no, the no, idea of like... Sir, do you know which robbery detectives are working the army surplus theft from the Cool Ridge? Caldwell and McManus. I saw Caldwell in the squad room not long ago if you want to speak to him. Thank you, sir. We'll it's um, it's in Rome, this like way. season two. Remember when uh, uh, Octavius just goes, "This will be a place of a moral high grounds and decent women and honorable men." And then everyone's like, "We're all gonna just have prostitutes all the time. We're just not gonna tell you." And he's like, "What? Eric? Yeah. No! Yeah, you got a minute? Yeah, right. You know, that's you know, like so that. That's not how." You're working the docks robbery oh. on the SS Coolridge. Yeah, that's right. So yeah. how do you see it? Inside job, either the guys oh, that's working Garrus. the wharves or some of the guys on the Garrus Vicarian. What else was taken? The Birdman from, from the Mass Effect. Case of BA. I don't recognize him. Case of Thompsons. Crate of the voice Smokes. or the face? The voice. Okay, because the face is like not a horrific bird. No. Shooting at the one not really. No kid. Kind of normal. I better get over there. Do you have a copy of the manifest? Yeah. Right. I'm looking Garrus. at it. Oh, I. It was. Yeah. Under my Dude, nose. So how do we connect the dog? Get ready for your tippity to the taps. 111 club. Is oh, I see Edward McOldrick right there. Yeah, it's in the middle. Hey. Nope. See if you can find a fucking. Uh, nope. What's his name? You have to caress. You have to caress the fucking words, Wooly. You're not really correct. Valor cigarettes, huh? No. This is the crate we recovered. What about the morphine? Half a million Surrettes loose on the streets oh, of LA. Oh, that's how many? It says two tons. Ooh, yeah, no wonder. Thousand. No wonder they didn't get them all. Yeah. And then there's the BARs. Hey, and some Tomneys. Here's our backroom arsenal from the 111 Club. Enough to arm three companies. Some of these Did guys it. are from my that own unit. They must have finally shipped home. Kelso, Sheldon. A Goldrick. McGoldrick was on the boat? Sure, we checked him out. McGoldrick bought the 111 club, Harry. His brains are all over the bar. <laughs> Looks like whoever stole the dope is getting muscled. By whom? Dragner or Cohen. They control the hop. Thanks, Harry. Stay I like the cases when they start with that little stinger. What do you mean? A bit more. I feel more engaged. What do you mean? You know when they start with the little shot of like, this is what might have happened, or the murder going down type of thing? Oh, yeah, because the these little, don't the, have the, it. The little action intro? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure only Homicide gets that. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah, and I guess it might give it a giveaway too much or lead you too much in one way. I don't know. But I think having those definitely made me like engage a little bit more with the case. Like right now, I just kind of feel like I'm doing another day to day. All right, this one had well, some guns involved. this is a job simulator. So. I understand that, and uh, I'm sure it'll pick up. Because there's no in like, but there's it's like, less you know. intrigue and in, like I guess these types of cases because <laughs> it's to follow the drugs. Yeah. Whereas before it's like mystery murderer. Well, right. uh, it's and of course, like to be real, like this is the job, buddy. It's not always gonna be exciting. Be thankful you don't have to do as much paperwork as you probably have to do in real life. You let a bullet go, you gotta ride. Someone was saying that. Uh, All right, where to? Oh wait, we're not done here. Is that another bug? Hmm. I don't know. 
Uh, some people were saying that, um, who was it? Someone wrote in and said, like, apparently, uh, originally GTA was going to have you play as cops and robbers. Oh. But, but like, the cop desk was going to be too boring. Well, yeah, I mean, you have to follow traffic laws and all that shit. Uh, I always get lost. Where's the stairway? It's right there. There it is, there, over here. Um, yeah, and so, like, the idea of, like, doing paperwork in, like, a GTA game would be like, fuck this, I just want to go back to playing as the crooks. Of course. And Being the, a crook's more fun. Yeah. What are you doing? I'm um, trying to go back to the room. Why? For what? To see, because, uh, like, like, it's not scratched out, so it feels like I didn't I know, but no one told you that there's anything else going all on. That, all that think. means is that at some point you'll come back to the PlayStation. Because all they mentioned was that you need to speak to that guy in the squad room, and that okay. was it. I guess it was also how the, you know the noise that played after I tapped the book. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that noise is usually the noise of like you are walking up to a thing you've already picked up. Yeah, because the book counts as a weird interactable item, and for some reason, it's not the only one. No, it is the only one. But then it wouldn't have played the. Yes, it did. It did that in earlier scenes as well, because the books count as interactable items, and in the cutscene, you're sitting at them. Okay, I I, I remember seeing it, sitting in a cutscene and hearing the final noise, you know the owner? but there I didn't hear it. Well enough. He was in my unit. Oh my Whoa! god, boy, what are you doing? It's amazing. Or then get blown to pieces back home. It happens more than you think. Maybe it's the car. Young guys trying to adjust to normal life. Wasn't blown to pieces, though. That's pretty much happened with my gra oh, what happened to my grandpa. Just bought a nightclub. Went all the way from like day one of the, the war all the way to Berlin, so came back and got like horrible disease and just wasted away. Quick, like a year after he got back. There's a lot of usage of the term comes into money. It's like the third or fourth time they've said it. Came into it. I came into the money. No, stop. Oh. New money. Oh, ew. A well, if you're gonna do that, it's gotta be crisp bills so that you dirty it. They're not gonna be that crisp Ooh. any longer. No. You well, our money, you can you can come into it all you want. It won't it won't get fucked up. Yeah, I guess so. Nah, nah, nah. Just make sure you get wealthy and not Negro rich. Yep. Wealthy. Can I get Negro rich? You can. Yay! <laughs> They're just rehearsing. New avenues have opened up for me. Take a break, boys. We would like them to stay, Miss Lickman. Hey. We're making inquiries into the Finally, recent deaths of again. four musicians. Since when have the police cared about dead black men? That's Never. This is about drugs. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> What we care about is two tons of army surplus See? morphine God. showing up on Roy the street. Damn it. Damn it. As you care about As a shining example. Town, you better give me something on Biddleston and Bo. Fuck. Or their knucklehead buddies, Tyree and Lamont. And this is your idea of making inquiries under Stonefura? Oh. I've tight. a thousand times about speaking that German gibberish at me, Elsa. Roy, how about you get a drink while I see to this? She yeah. She called him a pseudo, a pseudo Fuhrer. You motherfucker. Will you sit down? I don't get it. I don't want to understand what her plan is because the whole point of swearing at somebody in a different language is they don't Roy understand, so they're not mad. You know but Roy gets mad 100% of the time because he knows she that it's bad. Plus, she said it in a tone that was super evil. She oh, yeah. clearly doesn't give a fuck because yeah. she's so tired. I'm so tired. People are dying of overdoses. If you know anything about it, you need to tell me. I can't help you. A lot of cats are into the thing. There's nothing special about your boys. Mm. So she said, I can't tell you. She's lying. She can tell you. She could if she wanted. But she's a jerk. You have nothing. Terms like manifest destiny are they're like powerful words that just make you do the wrong thing but think you're doing the right thing. What do you mean? Like, people used to just shout, like, say, it's Manifest Destiny, we can fucking kill all these Indians. Yeah. Because the term Manifest Destiny makes you feel like you're doing the right. Yeah. Yeah, it's that's like all, a, that's all I'm saying. It's a glitzy PR term for just do whatever you want, as evil as it is. Hey, Wooly, I'm going to steal your ice cream. And how do you expect you know why? to prove that? Because it's my manifest destiny to eat. eat, eat the, yeah. you know, you almost got it out. Oh, man, I just, that fucking kill me now. Almost got it out. Oh, man. How do you expect to prove that Hopheads appear to get a free pass at the club? Yeah, how are you going to prove it, man? Piece With your shit. manifest destiny? Yeah. Your stolen ice cream? And also, don't forget, you got a manifest, so there's like a double uh, meaning oh, there. Oh, God. That's... I hate that. I hate that more Sorry. than... Sorry. My mistake. Sometimes you have to <laughs> shake... And now the, she's just like... <laughs> sometimes you have to shake the dead Negro to see what falls from the... I, th I feel like we've done that. 
You've done you that? You do this the easy way with me, <laughs> or I can Is call that what you're saying? Over. I can assure you, he's a lot less sensitive. Yeah, you, you want to deal with me or fucking Roy? Me? Black man don't supply nothing. You think there's a black man in this town holding on to two tons of morphine? He'd be dead in a minute. White man supplies, black man buys. Who's this interview with? Yeah. Everyone. <laughs> Who are you know, because, here? because she refuses to help you, but the black guys chime in with like yeah, little yeah, bits yeah, yeah, yeah. to help the investigation. They're, they're, strik they're strikers. You recognize them? I have no idea what you're talking about. I have no proof that you know. Or oh, don't but look, know. her mouth is going like. I don't believe you. You knew these men. And how would you like to prove that, detective? Yeah, prove it, idiot. Because proof means everything. In court Manifest. Means. That'll explain everything. No, it won't. No, it won't. It'll, it'll, just, it'll never work. It'll work. It's nothing personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that? Oh. That being said, I still doubt you. The only way you're going to get rid of me is to give me an answer. I knew Cornell. We worked together a few years ago. He loved the music, but the music didn't love him. Ouch. What does that mean? It means that he just wasn't that good. He was a sad, lonely cat. Oh, why does why that, that guy's guy ass have to be in front of that yeah, dude? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was and that a T-pose? No, no it was his weird. arms at his side. Strikers away. Why do you ask Poppy away. Just you and me. Nakaru. Uh, what's that Karuru? Mama. Mama. You're so full of courage. You have never felt ashamed. This is getting us nowhere. Do you think you'll win your war against narcotics? It's not my war. It's against the law. My job is to prosecute the laws of this city. Look at do this nerd. Yeah, seriously, nerd. I'm drugs, detective. Cyclops. I'm asking the questions here. Then why do you come to me with your stupid questions? <laughs> you know who controls the drugs in this city. It's not enough to just survive, Elsa. You have to try and make the world a better place. He can't even believe he's saying it. Yeah. So I, I'm gonna say this line. <laughs> I'm not, <laughs> and I'm gonna, not gonna be happy about and I'm it. I'm gonna hope that I start She's believing right. it by the time I get we to the end of it. <laughs> I hope I just oh. don't start choking while I you say know where it. To find him this time of day. You'll find him holding court at the Macambo. He can wait. There's something I need to be sure of. Give me till tomorrow morning. That's kind of an enormous amount of I wouldn't do. time, partner. Just yeah, but fuck Roy doesn't fucking care. Maybe, maybe another guy, maybe... Royal uh, just go play the horsies and then beat up the horse that makes him lose. Yeah. Basically. Damn it always comes in second. Why'd I put all of my crime money on you? Yeah. Should have put it all on I'm number three. I still can't believe the audacity of Roy getting mad at a boxer for not throwing the fight. Like, like in front of Cole. Yeah. yeah. Well, when it's the norm, it be it starts suddenly becomes the right. Yeah. Mm hmm. Everyone does it. Like therefore. if, if Wooly came in and just would light one object on fire in the office every, every day. time he recorded. Yeah. We'd be like, oh, there he goes again. Well, you know what you, you know what you do, right? What? You start putting out tempting low value objects <laughs> ah. out in plain view. Like what type of objects? Newspaper, uh, like like. Uh, uh, I was gonna say Funko Pop. No, oh, that's not flammable. And Those but things, they're very low value. How about, how about matches and candles? Yeah. Uh, no. I'm thinking of a bouquet of newspaper flowers. Yeah. Okay. Because that burns like crazy. Or like a straw man. We don't have any sprinklers in here, huh? No, we don't. Okay, so we can light as many fires as we want as long as we don't burn the it's place not, down. It's an effigy? Exactly how it yeah, an effigy. Yeah. Hey, can you guys burn me an effigy when I die? I mean... Uh, of you or of something Of you me. Hate? What does that do? You pretend like I was an evil guy or whatever. Pretend. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I just get the I get a kick out of the idea of somebody burning my, my body in effigy. You, but I don't think you do that once the person's dead. I think you do it when they're when they're alive. alive. Okay. I think. I'm not up on my cultist rituals. It's more of a writing thing. I guess. Yeah, you do it so that the person sees it. And I they're thought. like, oh, I don't like being burned. That looks bad. Like, remember they burnt the uh, Superman effigy in some Superman movie oh, that I God. hated, I'm sure. I'm sure they did that. It was me, by the way, who did that. They also <laughs> did that with, like, fucking hockey jerseys. So, yeah, you they know. Did. Do they like the player or hate them? No, that's when you hate it. So you just burn a, a, a crate of Leafs jerseys. You don't, We're also talking... You don't even take them out of the crate. 
They were also talking about a moronic sport where you're supposed to throw octopus onto the ice. Yeah, but only in, what, Chicago? Go see the face of the... Detroit, of, uh, maybe? Detroit, Detroit. Old, old goalies before they had the masks. <laughs> oh, yeah. They were a bunch of pretty-looking guys. They looked like Jason before. It's amazing. What's with this face? He doesn't know what he's gonna find in here. And he's worried about it. And he's so tired. Detective, I am so tired of your questions. It's very good, David Cage. Thank you. Hey. Of course. I like how calm she is about it. Uh-oh. Starts masturbating right on the What? <laughs> Tailing the tail. And that- and he has well, a tail, too. Yeah. What is going on? Cause Phelps is tailing the tail. And, and he then, got some tail. And then... Roy tailed the tail for the tail. Oh... Cole's married, by the no. way. Oh, he's super married. You see his wife in the background of one and shot for it. like one second. When? At the, the start very of the game. beginning of the game. Don't like, don't it's him pulling out of the driveway. And yeah. his wife waves at him. It's easy to Which forget table? it. Number three. Just like if it was for Cole. Me. Wow, Roy's not even saying nothing. Boy, that steak has seen better. Days. He'll he'll get his dig in when he can. Uh, waitress, can I get another spoon? That guy's face melted for a second. I did. I seen it. Between the tuna fish and the chicken. LAPD, we have some questions. Hi, regarding... Mickey. How's it hanging? Fine, just fine, Roy. I see you brought Iga Beaver along. So yeah, this guy's from Mad Men. Yeah. Me again. Paul Phelps. This is like most of the cast. He's also in uh, the new Twin Peaks. <laughs> he has manners. He's the guy who works in Vegas. Aren't you a little yeah. green for this kid? Me, Johnny Stompanato, Cole. He has the biggest schlong in Hollywood and the smallest gun. That's a real well, person, by the, the way. way Johnny Stompanato. Yeah. I believe Mickey Cohen is as well. He uh. He he pointed a gun at um. And how much fun it would be. Sean Connery. Oh really? Yeah. Johnny. Because he thought he was gonna. He's a service <laughs> man. Why don't you just call Cole? yourself Vinny, Johnny like Punchicato, or like Sixth uh, Marines, a lieutenant who won the Silver Star upon Sugarloaf? I've heard of you. Something like that. All right, have we finished flirting? <laughs> you got something to discuss, Roy? You're gonna stand around beating the meat while my lunch gets cold? <laughs> we have some questions. Stomps was a uh, pretty bad gangster. <laughs> why are you all thought, yelling at this quiet table? Punch a Gucci. He thought. Uh, he thought. Uh, <laughs> Sean Connery was gonna take his girl. Yeah. Because they're acting did. in the same movie, so he flew over to the, to the UK and pointed a gun at him on set. And everyone's like, what the fuck are you doing? And the story goes, apparently Sean Connery knocked the gun out of his hand. <laughs> and like, <laughs> got, him, and got, and got him deported. And then fucked his girlfriend. I mean... In front of the crew. He well, the girl, um, <laughs> I forgot her name, uh, whatever, she's like a famous old, old actress, but yeah, yeah. her daughter stabbed and killed him. What? That's four crazy. 14 years old. Yeah, it's pretty nuts. So Stompanato got stabbed. <laughs> he got stabbed by a fourteen-year-old girl, and it was ruled a justifiable your homicide. Lenny Finkelstein Oops. was selling stolen morphine. He had one third of the shipment. Old news, kid. I don't know anything about what Lenny was up to. <laughs> <laughs> that one's Check real bad for some you reason. You're mustering the guys who stole the morphine from the ship. You calling me a liar, kid? Yes. You think you can prove that in court? Huh? 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 Whoa. His face is a lot more stiff. Well, I think that's I think that's the actor being told be a lot more stiff because this is a criminal trying to get out of something. Mm, I don't want to talk about the <laughs> crimes. I have to protect my crimes. I don't want to. Mom, the policeman's asking me about my crimes like again. Mistake. Create, create a uh, a sack of amniotic fluid around your crimes. I just wanna. Oh, he's pissed. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he's looking. You saw him like fucking like losing it over what there. What do you yeah, just yeah, want? No, to keep it out. Keep on. Uh, keep I, uh, on. Like so, the nature of uh these two, I I, I kind of okay. So this is just the re reference to the heist itself. That's correct. And this is uh, the manifest that had your old army buddies on it. Okay, so as long as it and the items that were stolen. Okay, okay. For what we looked at in the ledger. Yeah. Right. Okay. So I'm supposed to believe that you don't know what happened to the rest of the shipment. Lenny, God rest his soul, was a moron. He was family though, and I haven't made a beef about that. So count yourself lucky, kid. The H is a filthy habit. I don't condone it. 
What? A simple solution would be to have all the dope fiends put down. So you don't know where he got the morphine. Kid, ask a question you might get an answer to. I appreciate that. I'm not going to tell you about my link. crimes, but I'll tell you where he looked. It's not my crimes. Morphine stolen from the SS Coolridge. One of those Marines was shot to death in a club last night. I wouldn't know anything about that. I very much believe him. <laughs> <laughs> Did you Literally see him swallow? Gulp. They actually animated the gulp. gulp.